Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel, my name is Marco and today we are continuing with more One Piece, episode 94 and 95. Last time we finally arrived to Alabasta and we saw Vivi, she became really nervous because she came back home and there is a lot of things going on. Uh, Luffy of course went on his own in search for food and he find this old fellow who has like uh, that dense powder that green powder which can artificially create rain and he tended to sell that to earn some cash and i bet it's very pricey because world government doesn't allow people to use it for some unknown reason we saw that it can literally summon rain and people in alabasta don't have much water as it seems the rest of the crew uh, Nami, Zoro, Sanji, Chopper, Usopp and Vivian Karu all dressed up uh, to not stand out too much and I really like the North Africa or more it leans more towards Arab vibes. I'm really enjoying it. It's a really cool setting especially after the snowy island Drum Kingdom. Now we are in Alabasta where it's very hot I assume and where its uh, deserts and whatnot and yes we saw crocodile fight of those pirates which i uh, said that it might be uh, a setup that he set sent those pirates to attack in order for him to grab more sympathy of the people because we know that vivi said that crocodile and baroque works planned to take over alabasta and then we have this rebel army which is still mystery to me i don't know uh, what's the deal with them? Why uh, why are they rebelling against who? Against Crocodile or against King? So that's going to be interesting to see. We also saw uh, Mr. Two <laughs> hanging out with our crew casually and copying faces. Interesting. Devil Fruit, Clone Clone Fruit. He even copied Vivi's father face. So that's pretty sus. They can use that to manipulate god knows what so i'm looking forward to next episodes without further ado let's jump into episode number 94. all right guys that was my reaction to episodes 94 and 95. the fact that luffy has brother blew my mind because we didn't see anyone from Luffy's family from the beginning of the show. Uh, we saw uh, Kid Luffy with Shanks and his crew, we know about the straw hat, but we never got to see Luffy's family and Luffy having a brother totally caught me by surprise and I'm so glad that he has a brother and he is such a dope character, man. Like the way he flexed, he destroyed those ships with his fire devil fruit. It reminded me of Miha slashing that uh, ship of uh, Don Creeks, right? And he's also going in this tiny boat, like it almost feels like a surfboard, man. <laughs> it reminded me also of Miha and his little coffin boat, so... Even Smoker is like, I can't be this guy, so that tells you how strong he is. And that makes me excited, because if Ace is going to be with us on this mission of beating Crocodile, so it's going to be a lot easier with him. So, we also learned a bit about him. He, uh, he is a member of Whitebeard Pirates, and he wants his captain to become... The king of the pirate which will uh, one day probably lead to their uh, groups clashing i guess and he's like the commander of second division and that pirate who was in drum island uh, blackbeard actually was one of ace's men and he killed a crew member a comrade that's pretty sus man so no wonder that Ace is after him, that's really terrible, and it seems like he is in Yuba, he was seen there, so both Luffy and his crew and Ace are heading to Yuba right now. 
where the leader of rebel army should be as well. So I'm extremely excited for that. So Ace, he has the D in his name. It makes sense because he's Luffy's brother. But the confusing part is that he's Portgas D Ace and Luffy's monkey D Luffy. So is it D that is connecting them? If so, there is literally connection to the king of the pirates, Gold Roger. So that makes me so excited, man. I, I can't wait to see more episodes and to learn more about everything. It's such a great show. These two episodes were really super interesting. And I like how Luffy was talking about his crew, explaining things to Ace and he was proud and with a smile on his face and the way they greeted each other by doing arm wrestling that was pretty dope as well. Really, really cool introduction and really cool character as well. So Smoker is like this persistent guy who doesn't want to let go uh, Luffy and his crew. He's pursuing them all the way from Log Town. But he said that uh, Crocodile is a clever pirate so Smoker knows that there might be something cooking and it would be interesting to see uh, what would he think if he finds out that Crocodile wants to take over this country? No way that he would be on his side, right? <clears throat> but then again, Navy is kinda sketchy sometimes, so I have mixed feelings. I can't tell what is going to happen, but all these big players, Luffy's brother, uh, Smoker, Crocodile, Luffy and his crew, oof, this arc is going to be super dope, so. I can't wait to see more guys. I guess that's all for today. Thank you so much for watching as always. If you like my reactions, consider subscribing, leave a like, comment, all that good stuff as always. I also have a Patreon page where I post uh, early One Piece reactions. I'm one week ahead, so if you uh, are interested, the link is in description. I will be seeing you very soon with another video. Until then, take care and have a nice day. See ya guys.